But we begin with breaking news in Parkville. That's where a major accident is causing a major traffic situation on the outer loop of the Beltway. Let's send it out to Captain Roy Taylor and Sky Team 11. Captain Roy, what can you tell us here? Stan, that's not only the outer loop, but the inner loop is affected as well. Beltway at Old Harford Road on the outer loop around 3.30, there was a little boy flatbed trailer that was hauling one of those Traco machines. Well, that machine ended up striking the Old Harford Road bridge, knocking it off the trailer. Now, about 50 gallons of fuel were ended up spilling onto the Beltway. They've had to shut down all but one lane, one lane on the outer loop. All three lanes are open on the inner loop. But the problem is... Traffic is backed up from Old Harford Road on the outer loop all the way down to 702. It's causing major problems on I-95, both north and south. On the inner loop, it's backed up all the way past Towson. And people trying to circumnavigate the area, if you're using Putty Hill or Joppa Road, that is a nightmare. And the other thing is, is that Old Harford Road Bridge is actually shut down, so there's no traffic allowed to go across the bridge. They are getting a building inspector or bridge inspector out here with a bucket truck to try and inspect the bridge to see what condition it's in. But right now, one lane getting through, outer loop of the beltway, inner, inner loop, all three lanes are going open up, but due to rubbernecking, it is a mess here. Reporting live in Sky Team 11, I'm Captain Roy Taylor.